Hello, this is called the 600 cell. Um, for those of you who know a lot about 4D polytopes, you've probably heard about this. This is built with zone tool, and it is made out of 600 tetrahedra. You know, it's the four, it's the, a tetrahedron is the 3D analog of a triangle. It has four triangular faces. And yes, this has 600. I know that is a lot. So anyway, I took a time lapse of myself building it. It really doesn't actually take that long. And one of the main reasons why that is, is because really I'm only building half of it. You see, at one point we reached something called the equator, which is basically just the flat ones that are actually um, polyhedra themselves. And like for example, here, this is a flat tetrahedron on the equator. These three vertices, three edges. And then the other, like kind of the far side or something, is basically just kind of looks like the same thing. So the, everything just looks like it's in the same place. So anyway, I just um, took a cool video of me making it. And it is a time lapse, so it's relatively fast, but I think it, should be good enough for you to see just how it works and everything. And again, I think it is a, a pretty cool video. So first layer is a point and then there's 20 tetrahedra coming out of it. As you can see, I am making this right now here. And then on top of those are another 20 more tetrahedra. You can see I'm making these. Then in between those are 30 more. These ones, I'm just adding a single strut for each. Right now, the envelope, after I finish this, will be a dodecahedron. All right, so next there are 60 more tetrahedra in circles of five. That's those little um, thingies you're seeing that I'm adding on. After this, the envelope will be a rhombic triacontahedron. So augmenting the rhombic triacontahedron, are 60 more tetrahedra. Really what it is is, you see, it looks like trapezoidal pyramids, I mean, uh, rhombic pyramids. However, each of them are just groups of two tetrahedra. So that's what it really is. So then there are finally 80 more tetrahedra of two types that are going in between all these rhombic triacontahedra. They only require single struts. And then after this, it is done. At this point, the envelope is a pentacus icosidotocahedron, which is an icosidotocahedron with pentagonal pyramids raised above its pentagonal faces. So you see, uh, that is it. So that is me building the 600 cell. Goodbye.